Hello, hi, how are you today? I'm Patricia from Twin Flame Reconnection. Do you feel some things? I want to ask you, are you feeling this incredible longing, like a real missing of, or that someone is missing you? Does it feel like there's weird feelings welling up from inside you and you don't know who it is? You're saying, is this mine? Is it not mine? It feels like incredible longing, like a wistfulness for a time, a place, a person, some point in time, somewhere in time, something that you need and it's somehow been unanswered. It feels like those spaces are like a nostalgia for some childhood thing where you have like the smell and the lighting and, and like it's a feeling and you just can't understand why are you feeling this feeling, that incredible longing. The longing is there on purpose. That is the magnetic pull of the heart. That's not just the magnetic pull. That is you feeling your other missing you from deep and long ago and sometimes even far away. Like meaning it happened in a distant land. How were you first torn apart, separated between the realms? I mean, these are really deep things, everyone, and they can be felt. And not only that, you're supposed to feel it. Now, when people go into denial, they will deny that this is happening. They will deny that. They're twin flame. They feel okay. They don't like that spiritual woo-woo crap. You can fall into a depression. There's a better way to do this. First of all, you really can't deny the true nature of yourself, which is love. It is that you want love. You need love. Love keeps you thriving. Love keeps you alive. But an actual new level of love that makes you thrive, that makes you long for more, that makes you feel unstable unless it's there, like really with you and in you, okay? There's enough instability. We have to be the ones to begin to bring internal peace. And then those kind of feelings can really throw off your guilt or they can really make you feel like, what was that? I was doing fine. And then boom, I got hit with these emotions. We understand it. Those of us who are activated and I've worked with people for years, I get you. I understand you. You got stuff to do. You might not feel like you have time or that you even want this. I will agree that you do not need the low emotions. Okay. But It'll keep happening until there's some acknowledgments and acceptance. That is different than surrender. Acknowledging and acceptance means that you agree, you feel, yes, you are, I accept this about myself, that this is the type of being that I am, that this is the direction of my life. You may not know how or why or where is it going or how to get there. We help you in the how to get there. We help you balance your chakras and really pull out those things that are so deep that you might not even know where to begin, but it does keep happening. The other thing that you need to know is that this isn't stopping. This may be the first time it's happened to you. It's not going to be the last and you'll balance out and you'll feel it again until you are closer and closer. You will feel things from that person. Our specialty is getting you to not feel the sickness, the low emotions, the things that that person has, their habits, behaviors, their lifestyle. I mean, what if they're a smoker? What if they're a drinker? What if they, you know, do some stuff? And you may not know exactly. You'll only know by how it feels. A lot of people have these feelings travel through their body. They are sensations. They are physical, tangible things. And yet there's nobody doing that to you. There's nobody making you feel dragged out and fatigued or depressed. 
It's very depressing to live without love. And yet even people who are loved, you know, they might have family love, brotherly love. It doesn't cut it the same way. They need real love in their life. This is a real thing. It is more than a phenomenon. It is happening to many, many people. Now, do not be confused that this is only a mental health problem because depression is more than mental health. Depression is a suppression of major organs, major emotions, the ways that you sense yourself. It is also frozen emotions. What part of you froze up like a little bunny rabbit because something fearful happened, something traumatizing, something really deep and made you miss that time that you knew peace and happiness and togetherness. And we need to get back to that. Finding the peace inside helps you find the peace in the land. The other people who are like you, and most importantly, the one that is drawing you with that tractor beam in their heart to pull you closer and closer. And you may feel like you're, you've are you got you know blindfolds on and you can say, I don't know. Well, you feel your way. You literally have to feel your way. You literally have to be like this, 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 this. And we help you do that because we want you to feel the good stuff. We, want, we don't want you to feel despair. The longing can sometimes feel very good. It can feel poignant. You can feel your heart rising. You can feel your heart longing. And sometimes you can't even, you'd have to write a laundry list of all those things that you're longing for. And yet you cannot articulate one thing sometimes because you know why? Because right then and there, you wish to speak the communication of the heart, heart communication, not telepathy, not from here, not from the frontal lobe. That's way too impulsive and full of all kinds of egoic stuff. No, that whole picture that speaks a thousand words. How would you love to send that picture to the one who loves you, to your other Twin flame to your twin flame. Sorry, I shouldn't say there's another twin flame. There's one. There's a lot of misconcept out there by now with all this stuff. I hate to see it, but you know, people are tripping all over it. And I guess they'll get there when they get there. What about you? Are you ready to really dig into your journey here and really do what it takes? Integrate your body, learn how to work the body. Get yourself rid of these low emotions that come from somewhere, somewhere in time. That incredible longing. It's lonely. This is a very lonely journey. And you can feel lonely when you're with people. And here's how we flip that. You feel very balanced and you may enjoy your hermit mode times. You may enjoy some isolation. You may enjoy being away from people and feeling good about that. We actually have a class. So if you are interested in really getting to be yourself and work on your light body and create that love bubble that lets you feel each other and not everyone else on the planet, that lets you feel the things that you should, that enables you to hurt communicate, then please join us. Please join us. Check the links below. If you need help in a one-on-one -on -one session, we do that. Check out my website at twinflamereconnection.com. And yes, the longing is there for a reason, but let's make it into something, shall we? Because it is not letting up. It's going to keep happening and keep happening until people get with the program. Thank you so much. Bye now.